I was sent this dual system spark plug tester and asked to give my opinion on it and make this short video. So here it goes. It's a very simple device, but it works really good. Let's check it out. This is everything you're going to get in the box. It comes with the device itself, charging cable here, actually a power cord. You're going to have to plug this in while you're using it because it puts a good amount of electricity through the spark plugs to do the test. It's just going to plug in the side like that. And you're going to get an owner's manual here that explains how to use it. So when you're testing, what you're going to want to do is just open up this case, put your spark plugs in here, and then you'll turn this knob here, and that's going to start to put voltage through the spark plugs, and you'll be able to watch and see how they're sparking. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how you, you set them in there. These are two identical brand new spark plugs. I'm just going to poke them in. They lock in place like that. And then put the other one here like this. And then we'll get down and close and look at how these spark plugs uh, perform. And then I'll compare them against a couple other ones that are that are slightly used uh, that I think probably still have some life in them. But you'll see how they behave differently as they're sparking here at the end terminals. Here we are. I've zoomed in a little closer and I've turned the lights off in this workshop so you can get a good view of the plugs here. So I'm just going to rotate this knob and it's going to start to light them up. You're going to want to use this safety guard here. Uh, but to avoid some of that glare for you, I'm going to remove that for the purpose of the video. But you're going to want to put that guard down. So here we go. I'm just going to turn on and start to bring up the power. And you can see we've got a nice, even disbursement of the power going through both plugs there. Lots of spark with these. Seem to be acting quite fine. So I'm going to turn this off, take these plugs out, and put some other ones in. What you're going to notice here is the spark plugs need to be of that typical size for like a vehicle, the longer ones. If you try to use a, a stubby one like this here, they just won't reach. So that's really not going to be an option for you. They don't fit. They don't plug in there. Even these medium sized ones here like this one, uh, these don't fit into the uh, device to do any tests. So those aren't going to work for you. You're going to stick with the longer ones and those will work fine. Now, here's a couple that I've got. This is an old one. It's an old uh, NGK. It's pretty burnt up. You're going to see how that spark looks uh, on this device. And then I've got another one here. It's brand new. This is an interesting uh, tip on this one. It's got this open-ended uh, portion here uh, that gives you, I guess, spark in more of a circular area there than just a curved tip. So it's got an opening there. We'll take a look at that how that performs and what that looks like. So th same thing, I'm gonna turn it on here. Now you can see on the right, with all that carbon and everything, the spark's kind of bouncing around on there. Probably not ideal um, with that plug. So you're gonna wanna clean that off, maybe test it again, and if it doesn't give you a nice even performance like you're seeing on the left, probably wanna get rid of that spark plug. And then on the left, you know, take a look at this guy here. He's really lighting it up. It's got quite a bit of dispersion of the electrical uh, flame there as the spark jumps across from the, the node there to the uh, upper part. And it's got that interesting design on that particular plug um, that gives it a really nice effect. So maybe that's a pretty good uh, solution. I've never used anything with that type of uh, end on it before, but something to consider. So... So that's it. That's how you're going to test plugs with this device. Really cool how it works. I really think it's um, something worth looking into. Uh, if you've got uh, a need to do a quick test on spark plugs that you own, um, then this could definitely uh, be the solution for you. So, hey, I hope uh, this is helpful to learn a little bit more about this Ansel SP02 spark plug tester. Hope this uh, video was helpful. And as always, hope you have a great day.